Hi everyone, welcome back. So, I have many a new updates. Luckily I have something to show instead of just telling you my ideas. Um, we can start with the obvious one. Um, I actually have shelves now, which I'm really happy at. I got two of them, one over here, one behind me. Um, they are a little bit deeper than I expected, which is okay. So I can actually fit a little bit more yarn in. They're also a little bit heavier, but I put in, I drilled into the studs, so it's gonna hold up fine. But also I started putting yarn in the middle um, onto hooks, um, so I'm going to put more up, I just kind of got lazy towards the end of it. So I'm going to probably put more underneath the shelves, so make a whole wall of yarn. So it's coming out along nicely, but I still have some more work to do. So I started making, next update, I started making the blanket that, out of the yarn that I showed you last week, and it's coming along nicely. The coloring is really nice, I like how it's on or being knit up in the blanket. Uh, nice soft coloring with the pastels. Not usually something I go for, but it's coming out really nicely and I'm kind of happy I decided not to go with a really complex pattern because I don't know if it would have done much for it. But also I'm putting this aside for a little while just because two of my friends are getting married so usually what I do when a good friend gets married or two friends get married to each other, I usually make them hand make the presents. So I got a hold of them a couple days ago and I was actually able to talk to them about it and what they wanted in terms of coloring. Usually this is a new, this is a new thing for me. Usually I just make them something without consulting them. But this time I was actually able to sit down and talk with them for a little while in order to find out what they wanted. So the colors that they wanted was purple and green. Now I was a little hesitant at first just because of the fact that I didn't, I told them, sure, great, but I didn't know how well purple and green were going to go with each other. I thought I was going to have a much more difficult time than I actually did. But this, so I drove over to Webbs and this is what I kind of landed on. So this is the purple. It's a nice deep purple. I'm going to put the info below. This is the green again. Um, both of them are not exactly a solid color. They're also tones of purple and green, which I like for the pattern that I'm using. So I started a little bit. I'm gonna. I will give you a full update next week on the pattern. It's one that I used before, and I really like how it's coming out so far. I think the colors are playing together nicely. So it's not an abundance of one or the other. It's just a nice combination of both. Um, since I got a color from each of them, so it's a nice, I want to do something, you know, a union, a wedding, something together, so it's a nice mix of both, and I'm really happy about it. So anyway, I will see you next week. Bye!